Hi, this is Mobile Max. We're working on a 19 Subaru Outback. We're doing the front drive axles. We're doing an oil change and we're Eric's changing the spark plugs. It's not a lot of room to work. On the driver's side, you got to remove the battery tray and the battery. And on the uh, passenger side, you must remove the air filter box. There's very little room to work with, but if you put your socket, ex short extension, and ratchet in one at a time, you can fit it in the spark plug hole. Also, Eric found that if you pull the coil pack out a little bit, it's much easier to remove the electrical plug. All in all, you just have to take your time and 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 go slowly eric you got any other suggestions on doing the spark plug job on the 2.5 liter 19 subaru outback uh i just have uh, various uh, extensions you know short ones long ones and uh just take your time what about you said like there's a, a connection on the wire uh for the uh the coil packs it it, it has a uh oh, so what does it have so it's got like this kind of release. Let me see if I can find it. Turn here. So the way you do is you press that button, the little wire, and it pushes down, releases the 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 clip to the uh, coil. So here's the ignition coil, and it just plugs into that. Um, and to release it, you press it down, and you gotta try and work it out of there. What I like to do is I get a screwdriver stick it in there and wiggle it loose and it comes out and that's how these come out but you want to take the 10 millimeter uh, screw off and get some wiggle room around here and then you can press it with your finger um, yeah and then you can release the, the pigtail it has this plastic thing here that's uh, connected kind of like this one here uh, down there it's not going to give you a lot of room unless you uh, pull this wire loose and, and then you have all this extra slack. Um, but yeah, it's very, very tight in there. So I use a very short extension. It's like about an inch. It's a 3 8 drive. And then I also use a 3 and a 3 inch extension. And I just change them back and forth. And then you use a special socket. This is a thin wall, uh, 14 millimeter. Uh, spark plug socket so those, that's what you would need and it works a lot it, work, it helps a lot if you have a swivel head uh, type ratchet uh, or else it's going to be stuck thank you eric all right 19 subaru 2.5 changing your spark plugs also uh the spark plugs are kind of expensive uh they're uh in i bought the good ones they're ngk uh laser platinums and this is what they look like they're really expensive i think i paid twenty dollars each for them anyway we've installed them and that's how you do it 19 subaru outback this is mobile max thank you